So social media strategy is always a challenge, whether you're a big business, a small business, and you talk about posting frequency, how much you need to put out, what you need to really develop content-wise to develop a following. And a lot of those things come up to some very basic questions. First thing is, is where do you get your biggest ROI in marketing, number one. Number two, how is social supporting that? And then number three is what type of results do you want from your social, right? When you start off with a strategy, that's exactly what it is. What are we gonna do with this thing? What are we gonna do with it in the short term, in the long term, and how do we pull in an ROI? And strategy components are creating a content calendar, finding out what your pillars are, as we like to say, of content. So we wanna educate people about our products and services. We also want to highlight our wins and case studies and build together a content calendar that actually builds results. The secondary thing on the strategy is you have to always look at the data to refine that strategy. If you set a strategy January 1, by June 1, that strategy may not work anymore. So it's constantly evolving. Now, what comes into that is who's actually gonna do the work? Social media management is time consuming and most small businesses don't have the time to do it correctly. And most large businesses are just looking to get it off their plate. So the big thing where social media management comes in, that's when the comments come in, the engagement or somebody yelling at you on social that you wanna ignore, that you don't wanna deal with. So there's different strategy to social media management than an overall strategy. Your overall social strategy should build your brand, produce an ROI and ultimately yield sales. But the sales part may not come until a little bit later, but it's brand validation. You know, it doesn't matter what size of company you are, you have to have a social presence, you can't ignore it. The management part is just ultimately time consuming and a huge drain on a marketing team or person that has a very small team just in their business. So at Bad Rhino over the past 13 years in social media management, we've developed a process and that's changed over time. Um, in some cases it's changed in the course of a year as Facebook's changed, Instagram's changed, so on and so forth. But our main focus is always to provide strategy at first. So you're working with one, maybe two people on an entire strategy. Not only social, but how social fits into your digital marketing plan. And within digital marketing, that includes your website, Google, paid ads, so on and so forth. But you're gonna start there and develop a strategy and work on that both on the short and long term. You're gonna have a short term strategy to get everything optimized and ready to go and then a longer term strategy to produce an ROI, depending on how that fits into your marketing ecosystem. Then you're going to have an account manager that works in with social media management, and that's the day-to-day -day stuff. You might have weekly meetings, you can also have monthly meetings reviewing data, but we're always in touch in terms of focusing in on what the current results are and what the longer term results are. But also with social media management, it becomes this giant thing. Once you get out there, you might have thousands of comments on an ad that you need to respond to. And it's important to respond to them and also find the stuff that is good for your business and also where people might be disgruntled with your business and reporting back on that. And that's all we do all day. And they have one person that actually focuses in on it for your account, larger and small. And sometimes on the bigger ones, there's multiple people. A lot of the pieces in social media management and where people get frustrated is you can't find the comments, you can't see them, sometimes they're just hidden. And we have tools that we can maximize that. So you're always getting the real data. You wanna look at that over 30 day increments and then 90 day increments. If you look at those things every day, you get lost in the weeds there and you're not really producing any ROI or results. So the recap there is you start with a strategy where you're working with one to two people at most to create a strategy that's gonna work for your business. Everything's done with a client's approval. We don't operate in the dark. You'll see that in a dashboard where you can approve it, make changes, make suggestions, and we'll make suggestions as well. But we'll create all the content, get your approval on it, and then post it and make sure everything is managed appropriately to keep your business in the right light, to amplify your brand, amplify your message, and ultimately produce an ROI.